Hello friends, welcome to another video on my YouTube channel and in today's video we will be connecting OpenAI Assistant to Telegram but without coding. So let's get started. I am here on a platform called Active Basis and what I have done is just you know register myself using my Google account. On the other hand I have an assistant YouTube demo which is just an helpful assistant using GPT-4 or mini and it doesn't have anything okay so if I you know run hi here we'll be seeing hello how can I assist you today I know it doesn't do anything but if your assistant is you know more complex it has you know file search functions all the stuff that uh, the assistant can have then that's fine as well you don't have to do anything uh, specifically here on open ai just make sure your assistant works well then you go to this active basis and go to new flow and click on from scratch now the way this automation active pieces works is you select a trigger that means you know an action someone performs or somewhere an action is performed for example a new row is added into your g sheet or a new email arrived in your gmail or any kind of trigger or an action there is a facility to create a webhook as well so you can you know put that webhook somewhere so on you know a third party platform if an action is performed you will be notified on the webhook and you can trigger the automation flow so in my case i'm going to select telegram and telegram has an you know uh, action or a trigger call new message that means whenever a new message arrives you know do certain things so let's create a connection so i'll say i'll say raj kapadia youtube demo now i'll need telegram boat token all the steps are written here as well but still i'll you know go to my telegram i'll search for boat father make sure you select the one with the blue tick and here you know you create a new boat following these steps slash new boat command you know give it a name and give it a id make sure it followed by uh, underscore bot so i have one you know demo board created and here is the api key this information is sensitive so you know you don't share the sensitive information with anybody you don't trust because you know it can control the uh, telegram board so i have copied that and i'll come here i'll paste the token here and i'll save it so that means this board is now connected so next what you want to do i want to go to ai section i want to go to open ai and ask assistant there are a couple of functions okay like custom call api extract structure data translate audio transcribe audio text to speech vision prompt a generate image ask assistant i'll select ask assistant again if i you know see here it will you know ask me to create a new connection because i don't have any connection so i'll come here and i'll say youtube demo i need to you know provide open ai api key so you go to open ai then under your profile i guess uh, under dashboard api key 
you you know create your api key i'll create one at this very moment i'll say demo key make sure you don't share it with anybody because it's again sensitive information i'll click here i'll copy this done i'll come here and i'll provide the api key and save this now that means if you know this is done we need to set another action that i want to you know send a text message okay select the connection we already have created one now we need to you know fill few information as you can see here exclamation mark here exclamation mark so i'll come here and here it will ask me to select uh, an assistant i'll select the one we have created now under this question section you know what you want to put so i want to select something coming from the new message so it says that this trigger needs to have data loaded from your account to use as example so i'll click go to uh, trigger and it will you know ask me to load sample data but when i click here it doesn't do anything and there is a reason behind it because you know we haven't sent anything from here so what i'll do is that i'll say hi okay and if i come here and if i click here load sample data now you can see we have received a sample data now i'll come here under the question section i'll click here so there is a message property under message property there is a text property that i want to insert as a question now you know uh, a memory key that will keep the chat history shared across run and flows you know keep there is information and if i click here uh, keep it empty to leave your assistant without memory of previous messages but you know we, we will obviously uh, don't do that so in order to provide memory i'll click here under message and under chat section there is id this id is unique for each telegram user so i'll select that okay and i'll you know close this now you can see the exclamation mark is gone and we have done the step next i'll come here and here it says you know uh, if you want to send message to particular id every time what you do is that you know go to this and uh, write this you will get your telegram id but we don't want to do that what we want to do that someone who has messaged our boat will receive the information so i'll go here and here under message there is a chat and there is id i want to use this id unique identifier for target message thread of forums and for forums and other stuff but we won't use it then there is a message section we want to send a message what message we want to send we want to send a message which is you know uh, returned by open ai but it is not there so we'll go there and we will you know run uh, assistant to get sample data as you can see we have got the sample data now we can go here and here under message section i can go here and i can go here then there is content under content there is a text and under text there is a value i want to insert this thing okay now this is done so there is a strong possibility that you don't understand all of these but what you can do is that you when you click here you can you know look into the information coming from the previous step and then insert the values that you want for the next step so now
this seems uh, working so I'll, I'll click here and it says you know failed response sometimes and the reason behind it that you know there are special characters and at this point there seems a bug that doesn't you know understand special characters so what i'll do is that i go there on my open ai under playground under assistant and here i'll write instruction you are help all always use backslash before backslash before spatial characters and you can see it is saved now if I go here I'll come here and I'll click retest okay this time you will see that you know there will be explanation mark to uh, not yet but I'm not sure why uh, let me retest this again always use uh, before every special character if I write high here character if I write high here we should be seeing something yeah but it uh, you are a helpful assistant let me make a uh, GPT-4 or oh, maybe it will okay so it seems not working but let's try one more time so if I come here I go there and if I retest this hopefully this should you know oh it did not did not do that so what we can do is that uh, there is something to format date let's try this one more time if this works but I'm not sure this should work because you know uh, so let me check with the format HTML let's do that I'm not sure this should work but still let's try this oh so I guess it was my bad. We need to choose HTML and let's publish this. Okay, so that means if you come here and now I say, how are you doing today? Then, you know, it will come here, it will go here, it will then, you know, send message to our uh, telegram and let's see yeah you can see so you know these are the things these are the steps it follows a message comes here it goes to open AI assistant and it sends back message and if I come here you can see I'm just a computer program so I don't have feelings but I'm here ready to help you you know how can I assist you today like uh, what is life Oh, great. So I hope, you know, you, you understand the basic idea. Now, since you understand the basic idea, now you can, you know, make the flow as complex as you want. You can, you know, add elements, remove elements. You know, even there are, um, uh, I want to show you, there are branches as well.
uh if i go here yeah there is a branch as well there is a delay there is a loop you know there is a um, uh, data mapper data helper file helper image helper crop an image rotate an image you know there are multiple things text helper replace yeah i was looking for this uh, previously text helper you know concatenate repeat a uh, replace split you know so there are so many things that you can do here so you can you know uh, for example here uh, you can create a branch for example once you once you create a branch you know you check if the user uh, is asking for something then do something else if the user is asking for something else you do something else so this way you can you know make the flow as complex as you want add elements into that but this is for the demonstration that you know with this platform you can achieve automation and we have seen one automation we receive a new message on telegram go to open ai assistant api get the response and send it back into the message so i hope you know this is helpful to you you have gained some knowledge out of this video and if you do so please consider subscribing to my channel that helps thank you for watching peace